guys, I'm finally back from Long Island. I am about to finish up my editing so I can get up the weekend vlogmas up pretty soon, hopefully. My intention was to have this video up yesterday morning, but we got home really late from the party. I slept in just a little bit, like slept in like 9 o'clock. But then my niece and my nephew were dropped off, so I was just, you know, spending time with family and focusing on that today is kind of a busy day actually this whole week there's going to be things going on here and there but um always when i come back from long island, long island i feel like i need to get my life together in the city like so i need to unpack put some things away clean up a little bit um because of course the boyfriend didn't do that while i was out and i need to do some grocery shopping and start working on a couple of projects but for now, it's 8.35. I'm about to get cracking on this editing. Because I don't have that much to go. You know, like I vlogged this weekend, but I didn't vlog that much. If you know what I mean. I didn't want to take out the camera when you're spending time with special people that you don't see that often. So, that's what's going on for this morning. I'm going to get some work done and I'll check in with y'all in a little bit. Okay? Okay. I just got back from... Trader Joe's, I got some groceries. I had a little bit of anxiety leaving the house because my friend texted me this morning about the explosion. She was asking if I was okay and I had no idea about the explosion at Port Authority today. And it's so scary. And I was tempted to just stay home. I was like, I don't even wanna get on the train. Like it just kind of freaked me out and my heart started racing. I hope that everyone is okay. Um, I didn't even, I didn't know about it because usually I get my breaking news from Twitter and then I'll go to my app, which is where I watch, you know, TV or whatever. Um, but I'm trying to stay off of social because I didn't see The Walking Dead last night and I didn't want any spoilers. So I had no idea about this explosion. And it's just scary that these are the times that we live in now and that New York City is such a target. But anyway, I'm home now and I'm going to... So it's a hard it's a hard shift to go from something so like you know something like this to yeah here's my groceries the <laughs> Trader Joe's so trivial gosh I'm gonna show you a visual haul of what I got I'm not gonna go through each I don't care nobody got time for that but I mainly like to get my frozen fruits from Trader Joe's for my smoothies and juices because they're so cheap I'm um, trying this out for the first time. It's a salad kit and it has um, honey ginger dressing. And I'm trying these two out. Falafel and this uh, chickenless crispy tenders. I'm going to try this out today. And yeah, this is basically what I got. I like this bread for making avocado toast. You always buy almond milk because I can't have too much soy. It makes me break out. I like this green juice. These are my favorite. So yeah, this is everything from Trader Joe's. This was less than $60. I could never buy this much food in my area for that price. Like, just never. Never. It's, it would be like <laughs> way more than this. But yeah, so I'm going to warm up, preheat my oven so I can try these out. And I'm going to have it with this salad kits and I will let you know how it comes out chickenless chicken tenders and I'll show you what my little concoction looks like here they are right here I just sliced them up I tasted it and it's pretty good the dressing is good as well I added some avocado and this is what I'm gonna have for lunch the dried pear crumbles came separately and then there was also oh no that's pistachios my bad Ooh. Okay, anyway, so the dried pistachios came separately, and then these are the dried pear crumbles. So hopefully this whole thing tastes good. I think it will. If not, at least I know I'm eating healthy. So, yeah. 
Do I know how good of a girlfriend I am? I am a very good girlfriend. My boyfriend needs $5. And his ass had the nerve to text me to tell me, Oh my god, I really don't feel like walking up five flights of stairs. It's not really good to get my heart rate up. Can you throw down the money? I'm like, dude, really? Really? Those five flights are your damn cardio for the day. But, but, I'm going to throw the money down for him. I put some change in here so there's some weight. He's going to text me when he's in front of the building, and I'm going to throw this down from the fifth floor. Men. Okay? Men. Finally, I'm going to try this uh, sparkling grape brush from Celsius. I think you guys saw it in one of my last vlogs. I've never tried this flavor before, so I hope I like it. so hard that something fell. It tastes so good. It tastes like grape soda. But it's not. I am greasy. I need to wash my face. Jesus. Okay, so I just took a mini break from work and I was unpacking my maleta, which I didn't do last night because I just wanted to shower and go to bed when I came in from Long Island. But I just remember that I didn't show you guys what I got from Home Goods. It wasn't that much, but I'm gonna show you. As I said on Saturday when I was there, I was just looking for some type of like Christmas decor. So this is my Christmas tree. This is as good as it's gonna get. It's a nice muted gold color. It's not um, super heavy, but it's not like flimsy and light either. So this is as good as it's gonna get for this year's Christmas tree. I think it's really cute. I don't know if I'm gonna leave it here, but for now, it'll work. The other two things that I got are Christmas gifts, so I can't show you. I also got this really pretty, like, shaggy ivory pillow. And you can't really tell on camera, but it has, like, this silver shimmer to it. I don't know if you can see it. There's, like, one little thing right there and, like, over here. So it looks really pretty in the room, like, from certain angles, it just kind of shimmery. And then, over here, this isn't from Home Goods, but I bought this months ago at TJ Maxx. It's a quilted mini little throw, and I just left it at my mom's house until we got to bed. I don't like the fact that the inside part isn't quilted. I thought the whole thing was quilted, but it's actually really soft and warm. So this guy is from TJ Maxx. And that's it. That's what I got from Home Goods. And I think that's it for this vlog. I didn't do much today. I just ran errands, did some groceries, cleaned up. Not cleaned, but you know, just put things away and did some work in editing. And um, I think I'm gonna call it a night. I have some material I need to work on for a self tape. So that's it for day 11. I'll catch you guys tomorrow, which is gonna be way more exciting. There's gonna be things going on. And I have a party to go to. Woo woo! Alright, good night. See you mañana.